everyone. My name is Minus10. I'm a middle-aged gamer, streamer, and tech enthusiast. And if you're like me, uh, you may have one or many of the Elgato key lights, which are a fantastic lighting system uh, to help uh, illuminate your streams or your Zoom video conference calls or, or whatever uh, video device you're using. Uh, one of the challenges I find is typically my main key light will not connect to the Elgato control center. And what I found is that the Elgato key light is typically connecting to the wrong Wi-Fi signal. What do I mean by that? If you go into your settings and you click on network and internet, click on Wi-Fi and then show available networks. Uh, most modern routers now split the 2.5 gigahertz signal, which your Elgato key light needs to connect to, and your 5 gigahertz signal, which is your high-speed Wi-Fi that your computer connects to, maybe your iPad or your, your iPhone. They're both split into two separate SSIDs. Now, m most modern routers will have the 2.5 gigahertz signal listed under the IoT uh, suffix, and that stands for Internet of Things. That's what your Elgato key light needs to connect to. Now, what I found is I can use my iPhone, and I'm assuming this works with Android, uh, to force a connection by the key light to the Internet of Things SSID. And what I do is I pull up my phone, I go, I click on Settings, after I click on settings, then I'll click on Wi-Fi, and that'll list out the SSIDs. What you should see when it shows your SSIDs is it'll list out the Elgato key light, and typically there's probably going to be four letters uh, on the uh, at the at the end of your key light that'll just sort of the, that's sort of the system naming of that uh, that device. What you want to do at this point is then there's a, there'll be a little arrow that points to the right on your Elgato key light. Click on that little arrow because what that will take you to is a screen that will allow you to change the Wi-Fi signal that your Elgato device is connected to. So what you want to do is click on show devices or show networks and then select the IoT uh, name, which is your 2.5 gigahertz signal. That'll force the Elgato key light to reconnect to the 2.5 gigahertz signal. Once that is completed, then the Elgato keys, uh, the Elgato control center should automatically pick it up and reconnect back to your key light. So I hope this was helpful. Uh, it may not work for everyone, but it's something that I found was useful. Uh, and is what I have to do when I need to uh, when when Elgato Control Center cannot find my key light. Thanks for watching.